What does it mean to be a human being in the 21st century? That's what we're talking about. That's what we have to be. That is what we mean. But it's not simply a revolution. It has to be a revolution and evolution and transformation. We have to be the change that we want to see. And we willing to stand up for that. Are we willing to stand up for that? Are we willing to stand up there? Young and old. Young and old. It's not only taking back our democracy, we have to remake it. We have to transform it. We have to build something better than that. That's what we have to do. It's let us down. It's failed us. It's failed us in our homes. It's failed us in our communities. It's failed us state by state. But it's also failed this fragile planet we live on. This fragile Mother Earth, which nourishes us. It's failed us too. We are on the basis, on the basis right on the preface of ecological collapse. And yet it goes on and talks about growth and development and growth and growth and making more money. Transforming the commonplace into private property and private wealth. It keeps doing that. But we have to change that. And we have to be here tomorrow, the next day, the day after tomorrow, and the tomorrow's after tomorrow. And not only to change it, but to ensure that its transformation is institutionalized. Just as the transformation into a country controlled by corporations has been institutionalized, we have to take it back and transform it into one that is for the people, by the people, that works on behalf of the people, and works on behalf of the planet. We're here today today. We're here to do that. We're here, to, we're here to do, we're not here to do anything short of that. And it's going to take of us, all of us, across the spectrum, young, old, black, white.